everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, then I welcome you. If you love watching handbag videos, then definitely hit the subscribe button. But let's go ahead and jump into this video. So by the time that you all see that I have a new Michael Kors bag to reveal to you all today. And I'm super excited about this particular bag because I did actually own its big sister back in the day. Well, like earlier in the year <laughs> but I no longer have that bag and the bag that I am talking about is the Sadie Large Tote. So if you all have been watching me for a while then you know that the main reason why I did not care for that bag is because of the leather. After carrying that bag I realized that I'm really not a fan of Michael Kors Safiano leather. So that is the main reason why I got rid of that bag but other than that I really love how spacious it was. It held like literally everything and it definitely made for a great work bag. Recently, I actually took a little trip to Nordstrom Rack um, and I came across this particular bag and I just had to grab it, y'all. I had to grab it. So let me go ahead and show you all what I got. And oh my gosh, it is so, so gorgeous. So please just like, y'all so the bag that i ended up grabbing is the sadie tote in the color rose and this is actually the medium size so it is smaller than the sadie tote that i did have but i'm completely okay with that because i really really love the look of this bag um and then i'll even show you all too you know the things that i'm able to actually fit in it also if you're also interested in uh, looking into getting this. So bag. to get started, um, I, I do really love Michael Kors logo also. And this is one that I don't have this canvas in my collection. But I believe that this color is like called like khaki. I'm not too sure. If I'm wrong, then I will leave it somewhere on the screen here. But yeah, I really love the color of this canvas and it looks so nice with this rose trim here too. So yeah, um, here as you can see, you do get your Michael Kors logo there. And I love this bag too because of the handles y'all. Like they flop down like so perfectly as you can see. Like that is just amazing to me. I love it. Now, this is a kind of a slim light bag, so I will also go over measurements with you too. But another thing that I love about this bag is that you get this back pocket here. And it is a generous pocket too. Like, I am able to take my phone and slide it right down in there with no problem. And you can't even really see it, as you can see. So it is a nice size pocket too, y'all. Love it, love it, love it. Now, I am actually assuming that this is this was an outlet bag because this bag does not come with, like, um, lined pockets at all. But this is how the inside of it looks here. So you only get two pockets here on this side. And then you also get a pocket here in the middle. And then there's, like, a compartment on this side as well. And this is the only thing that's lying right here. Large Sadie was set up this way as well with this middle pocket here. I do have the tag in here and I will actually leave that on the screen for you all as well. And then it does come with the care instructions also. So another thing that I really love about this bag too is it does come with a top zipper. So like it zips so smooth to y'all. Like this is like so bomb. I cannot, nice, <laughs> I can't speak enough good things about Michael Kors, y'all, like, I really, really do love this brand a lot, a lot, so let me go ahead and grab my measuring tape so that I can give you all some uh, dimensions, so when, let's start with the strap, so when talking about the length of the strap, It is about 11 inch strap drop. So really nice. And I love how this bag like hangs on me too. It looks really, really nice against my frame. Um, and then when talking about the height of this bag. So for the height, it is 
uh, about 11 and a half, almost really close to 12, 12 inches in height. But yeah, I would say about 11 and a half in height. And then when it comes to the length of this bag, it is 13 inches in length. And then the width of the bag, the width of the bag is four inches. So like I was saying, yeah, it is like a really like slim bag. But again, I am gonna go ahead and show you all what I can hold in it. I have my lid tote here beside me. That is what I'm currently carrying. So I'm actually going to see if all the items that I have in my lids will fit in this bag. So I just want to quickly show you all my lids and how I have her stuffed. Um, as you can see, she has a good amount of items in her. Just thrown around. So we're going to see what all I can fit in this bag. And keep in mind, too, that I am not going to be using these accessories, but just for the purpose of this video, I just want to just see what all fits in it. All right, so the first thing that I am going to place in there is my really large MCM pouch. This pouch, y'all, holds so, so much. And I'm just going to give you a quick glance, like, without dropping everything. I have a lot of stuff in there, a lot of stuff. So I am going to see if this will fit on in here. And it does. So we got that. Next up is my MCM Patricia wallet on chain, which I absolutely love. So I'll put that in there. Next up is my Victoria's Secret um, beauty pouch. So I'll throw that in there. I have this empty water bottle in here because I just came from the doctor's and I just chugged that down on the way home. So I'll just throw that in there. <laughs> and then I have my wet ones. My sunglasses. My keys. Which I'm just going to throw in a slip pocket here. I have some chewing gum, my fan. So it is getting a little snug, but I think that everything will work out um, once I uh, kind of slim down my, my big pouches. Because keep in mind, I have this big old MCM pouch in here, and my makeup bag is a little on the bulky side too. So the last thing that I have in there is this shopping cart, uh, shopping cart, this shopping bag. So I'm going to show you all how it is all looking. This is how it's looking. And I did put the shopping cart like just right on top of something, but that's how it looks. So I have quite a bit of stuff in this bag, but I was able to take everything out of my MCM bag as you all can see and then I am going to see if I can zip this up that is what we're going to find out now what it zips so it does zip up y'all and as you can see there's no wonkiness at all and this bag is a winner for sure so yeah that is how this bag looks stuffed the sides back so yeah i am really impressed that everything was able to fit in there um and again i can just take my phone and just slip it here on the back let's see if it'll still go in there with everything in here it does so my phone does still fit back there so i hope that you all enjoyed this video if you did then please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one. Bye.